Hello, Mr. Lang. What the fuck is this? We brought half the city or what? Hey, you brought a whole fucking circus with you, my man? What's going on here? Would you like to go somewhere else? Uh, we can chat right here, motherfucker. What do you want? I am here to apologize to you. And I'd like to clear, clear something up. All right? So, yeah. I was planning to eventually attack your sanitation unit. But I can explain why. Eventually? I already heard that you've already attacked us, motherfucker. And I can explain that. That's not me. There's another shot pretending to be me at the moment, and I have alibis to back that up. <laughs> I'm here to apologize. I didn't understand the full picture. I've been struggling to get materials for the past few weeks. I've contacted you, and I've been unable to get them. I tried a few of your workers. I've been unable to get them. I spoke to a few other mechanic shops, and they all said the same story. They said they were unable to get them. I spoke to Mary. Mary said that she was unable to get them. I was painted a picture. Sounds like a fucking you problem. It's, I was painted a picture... From what I, from the information available to me, that that you in some way were ignoring the mechanics, and I felt a little upset about that. So my plan initially was to ignore the mechanics. The I don't together. work for you. Let's get one thing straight. I don't fucking work for you, asshole. I don't owe you yeah, nothing. I, I don't fucking work. know you. I don't fucking do business with you. I ain't ignoring you. I just don't care about you. I uh, no, and I apologize. Okay, but essentially we were all upset, and so we were going to go. And we wanted to try and organize a meeting to try and find a fair price or try and get these materials reliably so we could try and get more business going between each other. And then I thought of some other schemes if that didn't work because Mosley's wasn't being supplied or so I thought it wasn't. I was under the impression that Mosley's and every other shop in the city wasn't getting parts. So then I thought, you know what? If we can't get the parts, we're still the part. But... I then learned that Mosley was getting parts and they were getting parts from you. And I didn't know that. If I had known that, I wouldn't have undertaken the actions that I did. And I'm sorry for threatening you and your workers. And that was bad on me. Now, in terms of your workers getting robbed, I have an alibi and people can say that they were with me. I'm not robbing your workers. There's another shop that's pretending to be me because at the moment I'm beefing with them and I'm bitching about their fucking material buying scheme at the moment. <laughs> and so they're going off pretending to be me, Rob Sanitation Workers, to try and get me a bad name. It's the shop down at LSIA, and I'm going down there to fucking deal with them myself because that has nothing to do with me. <laughs> I swear I have not robbed any of your trucks, and I apologize for my behavior. Yeah, all right. All right. So, look, I'm sorry for impeding business, and I'm sorry for fucking going around causing a storm. Uh, I'm going to go try and fix the people that's robbing your trucks, and then maybe I'll, I'll let you know if I can get something to try and smooth this over. I apologize for being a dick. I've got the full picture now. Uh, I understand how the dealings work, and if, uh, if I'd known that from the beginning, I wouldn't have uh, done the stupidity I did. So, uh, I apologize. Yeah, it's all good, my man. Don't worry about it. I guess, I guess that's it. Thank you for listening. No problem. Okay. That was a good TED talk, Dandy, I'll be honest. Thanks, Vince. Motherfucker's got a whole, got a whole circus with him. Look at that shit.